I'm Kim Ritchie. I'm associate professor at the University of South Carolina, Beaufort, and I study beneficial microbes on sharks. When I get on the lift, I start sampling teeth, gums, eyes, gills, dorsal and ventral surfaces, and then I just start plating them out onto a little petri dish. Colonies of bacteria will grow up and I can start subculturing them, purifying them, and, and screening them for antibiotic production. If they are producing antibiotics, do they produce them in a way that could be useful for human therapies? Could we use these as novel drugs from a novel source for human therapies and we're desperately needing new antibiotics because bacteria are becoming resistant to all of the antibiotics that we currently use. A lot of people don't realize that it's, it's relatively easy to work in the lab, but it's much more difficult to find the resources to get out into the field. Thanks to the generosity of Blundstone, I'm able to do the research that I'm doing now on board OSEARCH.